What's good everybody? This is Whiteboy503 and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to um A uh use a program called Dextor Dextory. Um what this does is allows well for what I use it for. It's a uh it's a recording program that you can record uh multiple uh types of audio. Um so of course I can record my uh voice and then I can record uh the game uh, audio. Um you can't use it to record how I'm recording right now. Um, but what we're going to need to do is, first of all, let's go to Google, because Google's my best friend, as you guys probably know. Awesome. So we'll go to Google, and you're going to need you're going to need some actual hardware to uh, do this with. Um, if you're recording like via like a PSP or something like that, because this this is uh, mainly what I'm going to show you guys how to do is record uh, uh, PSP audio um, and do commentary too. So you know what you're going to want to do is go Dex Tory dot com and you can go right here to their website I'll put a link in the description pro probably an annotation too and you select a language or whatever and um, you do have to buy a license if you're going to be using this for uh, an actual for for your actual program the license uh, I don't really know exactly how much it costs I don't remember exactly so we'll go to PayPal and I'll show you guys real quick um, da, 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 da. okay so uh, it costs 3,600 yen. Uh, I don't really remember exactly. I think that's like 20. I think it's like, I think it's anywhere from, well, actually, you know what we'll do? We'll, we'll actually Google that too, uh, to show you, see exactly how much it is. Um, yen to dollar. Or yen to USD, actually. So let's see here. Um, we're gonna go 3,600. 3, so it's technically, uh, 36, 35, uh, to buy it. Uh, you just enter your PayPal information. You have to have PayPal to uh, do it. I have PayPal um, to do that with. Uh, and you can buy it. It's simple, easy. Um, but if you, they do have a trial thing uh, that you can use. Um, it, it will watermark your videos. Uh, it'll display a... I don't know exactly what it is because I didn't really do it. I just kind of went out and bought it because uh, I had been recommended by a friend of mine. Um, so it'll basically post on all your videos uh, a big watermark like... I th it may say deck story right here or whatever, um, but it'll be seen through all your videos and it won't look very pretty. So uh, you can download it just to see how it works and everything like that. So um, let's show you guys how to run it. So you just open it up. It's really easy to install, not really hard to install. I mean, you shouldn't really have much trouble with it uh, installing it and everything like that. And as you guys can see, um, the profile for me is the Remote Joy because, of course, I use it for recording. Uh, PSP footage. Well, I'm going to start using it for uh, PSP footage uh, for the Let's Plays because finally got some stuff figured out. So you don't really need to mess with this tab all that much. It's the uh, Target tab. Uh, just basically what you're going to be recording and stuff like that. Uh, this next one is the Overlay tab. So uh, it'll write. This is basically um, you could choose which corner or where you want the uh, the FPS, which is a uh, frame rate uh, or yeah frames per second rate at. Um, doesn't matter where you put it I just put it down here and you can make it where it doesn't pop up in the video uh, I will be doing that um, I'll probably do it just to kind of um, I'll do it to show you guys how it exactly it pops up and everything like that and you can uh, change the color here uh, to the uh, non recording color uh, status color at, or and your color status so when it records it'll show you what color it is so actually what we'll do is I'll open this up real quick and uh, as you can see, it says non-recording status, so it's gonna the number will be uh, moving up down there. Um, so yeah, you can change that. And then once we start recording, it'll change to blue. Um, and this right here, what you're gonna want to do is, uh, if you have, you can do uh, I forgot what exactly what it's called here, um, raw capping, and we'll go over that a little bit more um, in a little bit. Uh, but basically, what it is is uh, if you have additional uh, hard drives and stuff like that, it'll cut the video into different it'll cut it basically into two different parts uh, for the first frame and then the second frame and um, it, it'll just make it smaller uh, and it'll put on uh, different hard drives you can set it to different hard drives and stuff like that I really didn't want to do that just because I, I just didn't want to do that I only have one hard drive on my computer anyway so I just kinda just do it as that so what you want to do is you want to come to your benchmark and you want to run your test I'm not gonna run it again because I like it where it's at um, and then it'll set it to however uh, megabytes per second it's gonna write it um, to your folder um, and then you can create a you 
Uh, yeah, out of folder. So um, I just put it on my desktop as the Let's Play folder, and it'll uh, automatically write it right into there. And here's this uh, hotkey. Uh, just I just use a set uh, use this uh, use default setting, and this this is basically the one you want to uh, worry about mostly. Whatever you want it to start and stop the uh, movie capture. I just have it as F12. I think that was the default one. And I want to, actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna change it. I didn't want to end. Uh, we're going to do, I don't know, we're going to do left shift. Shift. Okay, well, I guess I had to hold it. I don't know why. Um, but we're just going to do shift for now. Um, oh, I think it's actually recording right now. Ooh, yep, it is recording. See? So uh, it changes to uh, blue and everything like that. Um, my frame rates are pretty low just for the fact that I'm using the uh, Camtasia Studio. Um, I don't know exactly what it's called. We'll see here. It's a... Uh, I don't know what it's called either, so let's, we'll go over here. Um, I don't know, I record the screen. I'm using that, so my frame rates are going to be pretty low because I'm running two different um, recording programs, so I'm just going to end the shift right there. Um, so you go to your movie. This is where you choose the settings and stuff like that uh, for which codec you want to use and all that kind of stuff. I honestly, I just leave it. I'll just, I'm will just i just going to leave it as the Dick Story uh, video codec. It'll put it in small uh, portions, so you really want that. And this is what you really need to worry about right here. Um, basically, the higher the quality, of course, the better the quality it could be, but it may not be able to run depending on how powerful your computer is. Um, honestly, it still looks fantastic in low quality, so I would honestly just leave it there and, of course, compress it. That way it's not that big of a file. And then we've got the frame rate, and um, it just kind of uh, puts a, uh, I'm trying to think of how to say it here, a, like, a, a normal frame rate of uh, how fast it's going to go, which 30 frames is still pretty good. So I just re, uh, just I put 30 frames. It gives you a couple options here, um, but I just leave minus 30 frames. And the file output, of course, you, either you can do the um, a file output, so uh, it'll just uh, put it right here in the folder as it did right here, um, or uh, you could do the direct show, which uh, what this is basically for, with this option for, I won't be using this uh, probably for the near future until I get a better computer. Uh, but what this basically does is it allows you to do live streaming uh, through a different program, which I, I don't really know how to do, but uh, I may dab into that a little bit later uh, once I get a better computer, of course. So that probably won't be till next fall. Um, but uh, that's basically what that's for, and I j I'm not going to check it or anything like that. And the file format, like I said, uh, you can do raw cap if it's going to split your um, files into two different files, or you just the AVI, like I just normally leave it. And uh, you have the percentage here, uh, the scaling. Uh, I don't use any of this. The clipping is basically kind of uh, if you want to, like, um, let's see, how, how, do I, how do I say it? Uh, crop your photo base, or crop your... Uh, uh, your video. I'm, I don't really see a point in cropping the video, so I just, just kind of leave it. Um, and the per scaling, um, you could use this if you want to. I honestly don't know how to use the uh, percentage one. I just click the uh, default, uh, or not the default, but the size, and I always use, for you, like, for at least for the YouTube, uh, 1280 by 720. That's the standard YouTube um, video size, apparently, I think. Eh, whatever. Um, and then you got your default... Uh, settings. I'm not going to change this because it took me forever to get it everything figured out. Uh, but basically what it what you need what you're going to have to do is you have of course your uh, your mic which this is my mic right here. I'm not going to change it because uh, I don't want to have to try to figure out which one it was again because I have different ones on here that need to be named uh, the right ones. So actually you know we could do that. I probably, I don't know if I can rename it here. I'll have to rename it later. Uh, but definitely I would do that. Uh, name your stuff and I can turn up my volume on my mic right here. Uh, if I want to have it up higher, say if my game volume's a little louder than my speaking, you can't really hear it. You can fluctuate that here. And of course, I mean, for the PSP, you can just turn it down, I guess. Um, and then your second one is um, your, uh, your uh, what's it called? Your gameplay uh, audio, and this you can do up to I think it's eight. Yeah, it actually says right here maximum of eight. Uh, so you can do eight different things. So um, another one you could use is say if I'm playing Minecraft or whatever, and I'm recording that, or I'm doing a live stream or something, I can have uh, my mic, the gameplay foot, uh, the gameplay audio, and then the Skype call added. Um, if I needed to, I probably won't be doing that, um, but you can if you need to. Uh, the settings down here, um, the audio codec just. 
I would term the uh, PCM, and then uh, depending on like like I said before, depending on how good your computer is, uh, you can fluctuate which ones you want to use. I'm using the uh, PCM 48,000 hertz 16-bit stereo. Uh, that is for both of mine. I'm using the same exact one. So you can just fiddle around with it and uh, figure out which one works basically best for you. And then your screenshot is just normal screenshot settings, settings if you want to have screenshots and stuff like that. I don't really use that. Um, I this is the same thing use I use default settings just kind of leave it at that it's the advanced settings I haven't really dabbed much into this uh, but I really don't see a need to um, it does what I need it to so if you wanted to learn more I guess you could uh, fiddle with it a bunch but I just be careful what you fill it with I mean you may have to uninstall and reinstall it and your license and all that kind of crap uh, and this is just updating and stuff like that if they have updates it'll uh, check update and all that kind of stuff uh, and then here's your uh, the uh, info place. Uh, so I registered and unlimited it. It won't expire. Or, yeah, expire. It won't expire. Uh, you have the errors and stuff like that and all this kind of fun stuff. So now what we're going to do, or what I'm going to do, is I'm going to show you guys uh, how it looks. Record Actually, no. And there's there's one hardware that you're going to have to buy, and I will uh, show you exactly where to buy it and where I bought mine. Really cheap. I think I paid... Uh, uh, two dollars or something like that. Let's see here. Uh, what you're gonna need is a 3.55 audio cable, and so you have you need one of these a male a male to male. You don't need uh female to female. I oh, son of a crack. Are you serious? Hold on one second. I'm just kind of thinking here. I don't remember exactly which one I bought. I, I think I bought this one right here and that's crap because I just bought mine yep this son of a that's crap oh uh, no I guess this this isn't the one that I bought but you basically what you need is this right here I have one right here uh, sitting on my desk and I'll uh, plug it in and uh, show you guys exactly how it works um, but yeah so that's what it looks like uh... what you're gonna need to do is once you buy that and it comes and everything like that um... this is for psp record uh... recording uh... just in general if you guys want to do gameplay videos and stuff like that uh... what you're gonna want to do is of course extend it all the way out and you're going to want to hook it into the headphone jack of your psp then you're gonna want to take the um... opposite male end and hook it into wherever your uh... mic uh... headset or head your mic jack is so not the headphone one but the mic one so I'm plugging that in right now and actually I'm gonna unplug it real quick and I'm gonna turn my PSP on and I'm just using Final Fantasy 9 because uh, I'm playing through it right now just for fun so I'm gonna so you guys can see that it's there and I don't know if you guys can hear it through the mic so uh, now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna plug this in and you won't be able to hear it anymore um, through the mic or anything like that just make sure nothing falls um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit shift to start the uh, recording and let it go through just kinda talk blah 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 whatever uh, make sure the oh so that's pretty high uh, so it may be pretty loud so yeah, just uh, whatever you know um, I'm gonna hit shift again so it's gonna end the recording and then it's going to pop up here in the folder. Uh, so here it is. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, uh, this little piece right here, and you are going to view that right now. I make sure the oh, so that's pretty high. Uh, so it may be pretty loud. So yeah, just uh, whatever you know. Um, all right. So uh, as you saw, everything works perfectly fine. And uh, I just added that little clip in that way you guys can see firsthand of what uh, it does. And that's basically it. Uh, so if you guys have any questions or comments, uh, definitely put them in the comment section down below. Uh, you could like me on Facebook. There will be links in the description for my Facebook, my Twitter. And also, uh, I am starting. I, I started my PayPal account not only to buy the uh, the license for Dick Story, uh, but also to tell you guys that you guys can start um, if you guys want to. I'm not saying you guys have to, uh, but you guys can donate to my channel if you guys want to see more tutorials and stuff like that. Because as many of you guys probably know, I'm I'm, I'm pretty poor, so it's kind of hard to uh, 
do videos on other stuff uh, that I don't really have the resources to do. Uh, I basically do all the videos that I can with the resources that I do have. So if you guys want to see, um, I guess, more challenges more often, uh, it doesn't matter how much you give me. Uh, there is a link on my channel, and I will provide a link down in the description also um, to where you guys can donate to my channel uh, via PayPal. Um, so if you guys want to do that, that'd be cool. It, I, I'm, I'm telling you guys right now, uh, if you do donate to my channel, um, all the proceedings go to my channel. I'm not going to be pocketing the money and using it for uh, other stuff. It's going to all go toward my channel. I, I promise you guys that uh, up, hand, uh, up front because uh, I, I want to make more bo better content for you guys. So some of the proceedings may go to, may go to uh, challenges or pranks or something like that. Supplies to, buy, uh, to do pranks. Uh, or it may be supplies to get a new computer or stuff like that. Uh, so you guys can donate if you feel that you uh, need to or if you want to. Just to kind of be nice and uh, hook the white boy up. So yeah, uh, rate, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.